Hi, honey. This is Blake. Ivy43 has been asking me for this, but I've been like hell of busy today. So, two weeks have passed since the party, guys. I was so afraid of going to school after what happened, but thanks to Tom, no one really bothered me. He's the most popular guy here, so when he says something, people listen to him. No one talked about those pictures. I think they're all afraid of Tom's reaction. <laughs> of course, I'm not stupid. I know some of people probably didn't delete them. But what can I do anyway? I'm just glad they uh leave me alone. Will you be there tonight, Blake? Ooh, Blake is spelt with a capital B, baby. I don't think so. I, I think I'll stay home tonight. Come on, it's been two weeks. I know, but I'm not in the mood. Why? What's going on? Nothing. I just need some time for myself, that's all. I'll come another time. And I am still in love with this fucking outfit. Yes! Um, I need some time to myself. The truth is, I'm starting to think of my future. And I guess it stresses me out. Funny thing is that I'm not super smart, but... <laughs> I don't even know what I want to do. I could be... Oh, wait. Did it say I am super smart? Or did it say I, I don't know? Shit. Oh, shit. I almost gave myself a fucking heart attack. I could be whatever I want. Only question is, what do I really want to do? Um, And I have no idea. Sorry. Sorry. Um, I could easily become a lawyer or a doctor or anything I want. So, I can apply to Harvard, Yale, or Stanford, but what's the point if I don't know what I want to do? Girl, you need to be like a fucking guidance counselor or something, bitch. Or you need to be, bitch, like a, a, a psychiatrist, because, bitch. And, um, would Liam follow me if I had to move? Hell, fuck no. Nah. Liam will talk your ass into staying right where you at, girl. So that's why I don't want to go to Tom's party tonight. Because I can't waste my time. I need to find my way. And tomorrow's a big day. Agatha's family is moving in. I'm going to live with her, her husband, and son. And I hope everything will be fine. Liam's point of view. I am ugly as fuck, bro. I need to clear my head. I need to uh, get out of the gang for Blake. I know she won't wait forever. And for that, I have to find Pablo. But I can't rush things. It will be too risky. He is smart and dangerous. And he will stop at nothing to kill all of us. Back to Blakey. Hey, Blake. Hey, Aggie girl. Um, What are you doing here all alone? I don't want to go out tonight. Well, I didn't want to go out tonight. Is there something wrong? No, everything is fine. It's just that I need to think about my future. What are you talking about? You're smart and you can do whatever you want. That's the problem. I don't know what I want to do. And it's stressing me out, girl. Is there something wrong with me? No, of course not, girl. What the fuck? Like, <sighs> okay. Then why can't I find out what I want to do? Everyone knows that except me. You're young and still have time to think about that. I don't know. I, I'm thinking about it for a while now and I still have no idea. Blake, you always want to be, want somebody to feel sorry for you, bitch. Girl, get over it. What do you like to do, Blake, besides fucking complain? Shit. You can't get paid for that. Hell. Oh, well, actually, you can. Go on, get a YouTube job, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'm thinking about it for... Okay, yeah, whatever. Uh, Blake, listen to me. You're brilliant. There's no need to stress. You'll find your calling. I'm sure of it. I hope so. The next day. We went to the airport.
I'm so happy to see you. And this son look like he's pissed, girl. This is our home. Um, okay, oh yeah, okay, he's adopted. Blake, you can show Noah his wait, Blake, can you show Noah his bedroom? Of course. This is your bedroom. It sucks. Agree. Okay. Yeah, I know the bedroom. It, uh, bedrooms are small. Nobody asked you. No need to be so rude. Let me be clear. I don't want to live here. I have uh, to leave all my friends, and that's all because of you. Now I'm stuck here. I'm sorry about that. I know it must be hard for you. Yeah, whatever. Leave me alone. Bitch, hold on. Hold on, girl. Girl. You're looking... <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, I have to, you know, y'all have to gain my composure back, honey. Pablo will learn that Vince is dead sooner or later. I know that that's why we need to find a way to stop him before he tries anything. How? He's never, uh, he's never alone. You know, he, um, wait, you know him. He's not stupid. And if we go to this spot, we'll lose too many men, and he will probably leave before we find him. I know. Um, we're not going to let him start a war. We're going to start it. We'll go to his uh, districts, and we'll kill his men one by one every day. We're going to force him to show up. It, it is the only way. Uh, do I have to tell the others? Not now. I'll tell them the plan tomorrow. As you wish. I know he was calling Blake ass. Hey, sweetheart, it's me. I'm free tonight. Do you want me to come? Wait, do you want to come to my place? I'm free tonight. Do you want to come to my place? Great, I'll pick you up at 8. Good, because that little boy about to get his ass dragged. I love you too. I should change. Liam will be here in a few minutes. What can I wear? Well, why in the hell can you wear what the hell you had on? That was cute. Oh, well, this is cute too, girl. Whatever. No, that's ugly. No, I'm going to go with the first one. I'm going out. Okay, be careful. See you tomorrow. So what I miss? Nothing special. I stayed home studying all weekend. And Agatha's family moved in. How is it? Are they nice? Richard's very nice. But their son seems to be mad. And I understand him. He had to leave his friends to move here. Yeah, that's understandable. Anyway, I'm glad you found some time for me. I always have time for you. So y'all about to have sex or what, girl? So, oh wait, I know that sometimes I'm busy, but I always, I'm always thinking about you. I'm crazy about you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they were to do, do the nasty, y'all. I was so scared to be so close to a boy for so long, but Liam changed that. He showed me that there is nothing to be afraid of. He taught me that love was the most beautiful thing on earth. <laughs> Meanwhile, who the fuck is this? This Pablo and him. It gotta be. I have some important news, boss. I'm listening. Vince is dead. What? How? I don't know. They say it was you. Me? When did it happen? Two weeks ago. 
two weeks ago. Are you fucking kidding me? Why didn't you tell me before? Because there's too much suspicion, boss. I couldn't leave them like that. I was with them all the time. And if anyone finds out the truth, I'm a dead man. I should kill you. Hell, I was a, I was supposed to end his fucking life. After what he did to me? Don't kill me, boss. You oh, Wait, don't kill me. You need me, boss. No, do he really need you? No, no. They trust me. You can't replace me now. You're lucky. Do you have any idea who did this? No, I don't know. I don't see why any of them would want to kill well, would kill him. Who is in charge of the gang now? It's Liam. Of course it's him. You have no idea how much I'm pissed off right now. Damn it. How could this happen? I don't know, boss. I've had enough. They're all going to pay for what they did. Starting with Liam. He doesn't have what it takes to be a gang leader. I need to get him, I need to get back at him. I may know how you could do this. What are you talking about? Get Blake. We met Liam's girlfriend a few weeks ago and he seems to really care about her. Liam has a girlfriend? Yeah, he's stupid enough to love someone. No offense. This is perfect. I couldn't think of anything better. This, this bitch, this, them keep kidnapping Blake or going for, this shit getting old. Like, can you come up with something else, girl? This shit is dead. Uh, I need to plan my revenge. I want to know everything about her. Everything. Do you hear me? Yes, boss. You can count on me. Fine. And Pablo, bring your ugly ass out here. What are you still doing here? Get out and do your job. Monday morning. This is it. Let me introduce you to my friends. No thanks. Blake, you being too nice, bitch. I wouldn't want. I wouldn't introduce him to shit. I'd be like, "This is it, girl. See you later." Bitch, see you back. He hates me. Let him. Um. Let him some time. He just moved here. I bet it's not easy for him. I know. Meanwhile, boss, it's me. Liam just told us his plan to get back at you. He wants us to come to your district tonight and kill all of the men who will be working there tonight. How dare he? Dares he? How dare he? Anyway, we'll be waiting for them. Be careful tonight because the blood will flow. Is Blake pregnant? Are you okay? I'm not feeling very well. I think I'm sick. I should go home. Yeah, go home. I'll tell the teacher. Thank you. Later. It's time. Take the cars, go to their streets, and kill them all. They won't see it coming. Yes, they will, because that bitch just snitched. Hey, Richard told me that you're not feeling well. You, sh uh, you should have called the doctor. It's okay. No, it's not. Tomorrow we'll call him. Uh, do you want to eat something? No, I'm not hungry. I just want to sleep. I'm tired. Call me if you need anything. Bitch, you are a doctor. What the fuck are you talking about? Even though you are, I'll be... I'll be too right here. Wait, bitch, you a doctor, though. How is she? She's not feeling well. I'll call the doctor tomorrow. She can't stay like that. It must be the flu or something. Or the bitch must be pregnant. What if it's not, right? What are you talking about? What if she's pregnant? Thank you. Oh, come on. You don't even know if if they did it. You always see the worst in things. She seems to have uh, the same symptoms. You're thinking too much. I swear, if he got her pregnant, I will kill him myself. 
Honey, calm down. I'm not sh I'm sure it's nothing. You're worried. You're worrying for nothing. You'll see. I hope so. Bitch pregnant. Blake is pregnant, y'all. Meanwhile, all these fucking meanwhiles, girl. Uh, we need more dope. I'll go tomorrow. They knew it. They knew we were coming. They were prepared. They were not working. They were waiting for us. How is that possible? Only one possibility. We got a mole in there. Someone told them that we were coming. Who could it be? I have no idea, but one of us is definitely working for Pablo. We need to find out uh, the traitor. We need to find that. Oh, we need to find that traitor. How? I don't know, but I'll find him. We need to watch every guy. There's too many. We can't watch them all. We don't have a choice. This will be my first priority. Okay. I will continue it for updates and sneak peeks. All right, y'all. Uh, she didn't tell me when it's coming out, so don't ask because I can't tell, girl.